Once upon a time, an old man crossed a bridge into a city that looked sad and dark even in the daylight. Can a city cry? Well, if a city could, then this one would. The Ferris wheel stood still and rusted. No one would dare to swim in the lake filled with trash and neglect. The gates of the city were broken when the flower man walked toward them, but he was glowing as if he knew a secret. Well, no one notices the flower man, despite his glowing and even his chuckling as he seems to challenge the despair, the division, the danger, and the darkness all around him. The city is blind to him. They are looking down, looking down the way people do when they have given up. The flower man finds a run-down house in the center of town and says, this'll do just fine. Strangely, no one notices him as he literally glows with anticipation. The young girl is preoccupied with her boredom. The man sits in a bath but never feels clean. The painter stares at the blank canvas. The elderly woman carries too much. The thief is plotting and no one notices the flower man. No one except the little girl next door. The flower man sets to work, replacing brokenness with beauty. Two little girls are just in awe. A few adults who brave a glance are mostly cynical or even offended. Most of the folks from the sad city hurry by without even looking up. And then it happened. The moment the flower man knew would come, he knew it would change everything. And just as the thief was plotting to steal the beauty that the neighbor still didn't understand, the flower man gave it away. A gift so delicious that the little girl next door begged her mommy for one. The milkman was plain old shocked, but the artist was inspired. The flower man gets busy doing what he came to do, giving flowers away. The city seems to whisper and even shout, life is coming. The streets are aglow with it. Can it come to the fountain? The little boy asks. It is coming to my canvas, the artist declares. It has come to my window? The bathing man amuses. Despite the beauty all around, to some, life can be frightening. So the little girl next door says a quiet goodbye and has moved quickly away. But life makes the old woman smile and the old man scratches his head. The mother prays, the beggar receives, and the thief weeps. Because life cannot be stolen, it can only be given away. The flower man has a cookout and the streets turn into a block party. Dancing, music, laughter, and games. Loneliness is swallowed up by joy. The canvases are beautiful. The stories of the ancients are told. Intimacy is in the window, and the fountain is flowing again. Joy lights the night. Games and music fill the streets. Their hearts are pulsing with life. Their hands are filled to overflowing. They cannot see over it. They cannot see that the flower man has packed up his bag of seeds and journeyed on. The flower man leaves the city aglow with love answered prayers and hope. Why did he leave? He left because there is someone who needs a flower, someone who couldn't get to him, so he will go to them and he will bring them life.